guys, I'm here with a, as you can see, a wig tutorial. I look bald headed, like I don't know what, that is hilarious. But um, yeah, so I'm here with a lace front tutorial and this is long awaited, as you guys know, I don't have time. But I'm taking the time out, since I'm not working right now, to do this. So the wig I'm gonna be reviewing is from misswigs.com and it is called Miss J. And this is what she looks like. The lace front. See, I didn't cut the lace yet. I didn't even take the tag off. I've had this probably for about, I don't know, six, seven months and never got around to doing a review on it. I just bought it and put it away. But isn't she pretty? Those are some of the prettiest curls and this hair is so soft, y'all. It's so soft. Okay, so you have the lace. It's not a full lace, it's a lace front. So this is about how much lace you get. You see that? And it has two combs on the side. One here, one here. And it has the adjustable straps, which is awesome. And it has the comb in the back, which I will not be using, but here are the adjustable straps. So I'm gonna go cut the lace off and put her on. Actually, yeah, I'll tell you about that in a minute. So I'm gonna cut the lace, I'll be right back. Okay guys, so this is Miss J. <laughs> Miss J is a lot of hair. As you can see, I look crazy. If you like big hair, you like Miss J. Yeah, this is a lot of hair. Um, I mean, it's a lot of hair, but it can be tamed. Like, you can take your water bottle, and just spritz it, spritz it down. I'm not going to do that because I have plans for this hair, and this is not one of them. Uh, let me get a little closer so you guys can see the hairline. require any glue or tape. That's one thing about this wig. I won't be wearing it back so the hairline really doesn't matter to me. I will be wearing it forward like this. And I'll show you guys the parting space which is not much but it's doable. So when you go to misswigs.com, you'll see the picture on the site, and this is all it comes with on a tag. So, yeah. And on this tag, it just says lace front wig, premium quality, new Futura fiber, and it's Miss J, and this is in the color 1B. basically caring instructions, how to wash it. Now, one thing I can say about this wig is you can flat iron it. Now, if you guys are familiar with my channel, a while back I did a, um, a contest for a celebrity lookalike contest. I hosted that. And in that 
video, I actually have this wig on, flat iron. And I loved it so much, I bought two more. Now this one is, I would say this one is the uh, 18 inch one. And I have another one that's actually longer than this one. And that's the one that you see in that video. And I cut it, I chopped it up, I flat ironed it, and that's what it looks like. So if you wanna know what this looks like straight, go to that video, the um, Celebrity Lookalike Contest video, and you'll see me and you'll see this wig straight. So basically I won't be flat ironing it on camera. I mean, I might, but I don't really feel the need to. So yeah. With that being said, this is, oh God, so much hair. That's probably why I cut it in the first place. I mean, you can put it back in a ponytail. You can rock it like that. That's cute. You can do that. But it's really long. I'll show you how long it is. some kind of curl activator on it to activate these waves. But there's so much different things you can do with this wig. Like I can play with it all day. It's just so much. Like you can part it, style it whatever way you want. so busy you're not gonna really care about baby hairs I mean you can always pull some of your hair out in the front but I think that's a pretty good hairline and damn I'm gonna leave all the information below because I don't remember how much I paid for it but it wasn't a lot which is one thing I like about Miss Wig she her stuff is really inexpensive so yeah what it looks like. Back up. So it's really cute. I like it. It's long, but whatever. So yeah, guys, that's my wig review on my lace front from Miss Wigs, and I hope you enjoyed. Hope you like it. I will leave a link for this eye look. So stay tuned for that. Bye. Okay guys, so I'm back. Sorry, I know I said it was gonna be the end of the video, but um, as I was sitting here, I was just, just like, you know what, I'm gonna tame it. I'm not gonna flat iron it. Because when I said earlier, I had other plans for it. I don't wanna flat iron it. I don't wanna wear straight hair. So, so far as you can see, I actually spritz the side with water. And one thing about this wig, you do not want to comb it. You don't wanna brush it, because it's just gonna make it bigger. So I took my little water bottle and I got this from Family Dollar for a dollar. <laughs> and I just put water in it and I lightly spray the hair. And I just finger through it. I do not want to comb it. The hair is really soft so as soon as it gets wet, it, it weighs up even more. Once you do that, just work the water through the hair with your hands like so. And it basically tames the hair, so it's not so big. See, it's not so big anymore. But I had to show you guys that. I was like, let me film this and show them what it looks like, you know, tamed instead of all over the place. So I'm gonna do the back, I didn't do the back yet. This is just water. It's not any type of product, anything like that. It's regular water. 
Now, I don't know what's going to happen when it dries and probably go back to its fluffy state, but if that happens, then I will use product, and the product that I will use is this S-Curl Texturizer. And I got this from my local beauty supply store, and I paid $5 for it. Actually, this was my husband's. I took it from him. Yeah. So I'm going to use this. And this, it basically is styling spray, moisturizer for waves and shortcuts. So that's what I have is a wave. And that's it. So this hair is just like so pretty. It's ridiculously pretty. I didn't even know when I first got it, I didn't know it was going to be that pretty. I, ne I never wet it. I didn't even give it a chance wavy. I just went ahead and took the flat iron and made it straight. But had I known this, that it would look like this, I wouldn't have did that. I would have kept it in its natural, wavy, curly state. So I put a little part here, which I'm gonna fix that up later. And I just wet it. And this is the results of it wet. And I love it. I am totally in love with this hair. This is really pretty. So the back looks like wet. It's really pretty, flowy, and it's really soft. Like this hair is really, really soft. Yeah. Let me see. Let me stand up so you guys can see. Yeah, my shirt is soaking wet, but it'll be all right. So, yeah. That's how it looks wet. And that's really pretty. Like, I really like this hair. So, again, bye. I <laughs> just wanted to show you guys that.